A gift of a lifetime is making a difference for two city employees in Green Bay. After working together for years, the two became good friends. And when one was sick and needed a kidney transplant, the other stepped up in a big way. It's a gesture that's now helping others through a benefit today at City Hall. Fox 11's Eric Peterson has the story. Cheryl Renier Wig says a rare form of cancer destroyed her kidneys about three years ago. Unfortunately, it was, we were not able to save them. So I went on dialysis for a little over a year. Co-worker Andy Rosendahl made a lighthearted suggestion. I always said, you can have my kidney, don't worry about it. Your kidney's my kidney. And we all kind of joked about it, thinking, oh, you know, what are the odds someone's going to be a match? And he was a match. For Rosendahl, it was an easy choice. It didn't cross my mind twice. I knew that it was going to be great for her health, um, and I knew in all the research that I did that I could do this. The transplant was in February. I mean, I feel 100% better right now. The two have been back at work for about a month, and their story was the basis for the kidney campaign. Money from Thursday's benefit will help cover medical expenses for both families. The event also raised awareness about organ donation. You don't have to be a living donor, but get that little orange sticker on your license and uh, make sure that if the opportunity presents itself, you can help someone else. It really takes a special person to uh, really donate a kidney um, to you know a fellow employee, but really not you know a family member. And you know this Andy Rosenthal is a very special person. I always felt like Andy was my son, <laughs> even when he was my employee. You know we had that kind of relationship together. So um, and now it's kind of nice because his extended family I feel is part of my family as well. You proud of the kid? Oh my god. Are you kidding me? He gave me a kidney. <laughs> In Green Bay, Eric Peterson, Fox 11 News. Oh, pretty awesome. Well, more than 120,000 people nationwide are waiting for an organ transplant, and that includes more than 2,200 right here in Wisconsin.